so it's time to do a wee update on the DAX. Converted it, must be two years ago now. Haven't used it very much since, but however, on the times I have used it, she's been good fun. Uh, also been totally reliable. The only thing I had to do was change this isolator on the carb. That was giving me a bit of problems, I had to clean the carb out. Probably just because it was lying so long. Everything else seems to be fine. Yeah, some of the mods that was done with the bike, just as a, a little reminder, was that it's a Honda C90 electric start engine. The original engine was uh, painfully slow. The little two and a half horsepower, 12 volt, 50 cc. I just felt it was um, too dangerous you know, to keep up with traffic, etc. So it's went for two and a half horsepower to a whopping seven and a half horsepower. Wow, really pulls your arms out. <laughs> yeah. However, I'm saying that it is, it's, it's much more rideable now, it's much more usable, and that was the idea for me to do this. I actually had that engine in my loft for 25 years. We used to do work for a dealer, and he would throw us some uh, parts and things, and I'd always wanted to do one of these bikes and convert it to an electric start, because at that time, obviously, it was the older models. Uh, the new Daxes or the new monkey bikes have the electric start 125 engine, but these old ones never ever had an electric start. I didn't want to go down the Chinese route with the bike, so I got good use of the engine when the opportunity came. And also using the C90 switches here for the for the electric start and try to keep it as much Honda as possible so she's really good to ride and I'm going to take her today over a hill quite a high hill actually and my daughter's going to go in the back so sit back and relax and I'll take you for a little ride on the Dax. Now we've got the way in suited and booted. Let's bring the bike round and get going. Hold on tight.
So there we go. In conclusion, very pleased with the bike. I really like it. It's not the fastest thing in two wheels, but then it was never designed to be like that. Uh, the engine certainly has improved it. It's easy just to jump on the bike and ride. Just to nick out to the shops or just bimble about the lanes around about here. And that was the whole plan for it. A big thanks to Bob for his help with the conversion, for the use of his lathe and his electrical skills. So that certainly helped the project along. And although I don't use it very much, it's nice to know that it's there. I keep it taxed, insured and on the road, MOT'd, etc. So that I can just jump on it whenever I, I like. And yeah, very pleased with it. So ride safe, take care of yourself and thanks for watching.